welcome to Carol's Current Obsession. I have something fun today. I've been waiting for this girl for a while. My friend Lehman, she had got a dream fairy doll and I loved it and I thought I have got to find me a dream fairy doll. So I went on to AliExpress and I got one. I'm trying to remember who she came from and I think that the name of it is Dream Fairy Doll. I'll put it down below. Oh, we have two boxes. Dream Fairy DBS Cold Diffusion. Wow. Okay, pretty good box here. Okay, let's see if the one we got is pretty as Lehman's. Oh, how fun. They sent a little extra doll. This was on a special, buy one, get a friend for free or something like that. But uh, she looks kind of like a little Blythe, but not quite. More like a little pull-up. Oh, that's fun. She looks like a little pull-up doll. Although she looks a touch cross-eyed. Yes. And she has painted on yellow bloomers and a little teeny dress, which is fun. Oh, and her legs even bend. Woo! She's a jet set girl. Ta-da! <laughs> okay, well that's fun. A little freebie doll. Oh, very nice. The head. We've done well on that. Let's take it off. Alien mask. Wah, 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 wah. All right, let's see. Oh my goodness, she is beautiful. Very lovely, and her pretty hair, too. That's a great hairdo. Awesome. That's an interesting neck, though. Look at that. We'll see how that's going to fit in. I don't know how it's going to work out. Here she is. Oh, well, I guess let's look at her feet first. A little bag of extra goodies here. Oh, those are good feet. Let's see. Oh, freakishly long toenails. But you know what? It could be painted. Yeah, that's good. And it's a heavy quality plastic. It's not resin, but it's heavy, heavy plastic that feels like resin, but, but isn't. And it looks like she has some hands as well. I wonder if these are extras or her hands in actuality. Oh, they have beautiful nails. Looks like we can paint her nails very nicely. And looks like she has a little package earrings and hair clips. Oh, very nice. Very pretty little clips. I got two of those and a little set of earrings in here. Those are great little shoes. Look at that. Very nice little shoes. Very pretty. Great little shoes. Release the doll. How nice they put her in this blanket. Ah, they are extra hands because she already comes with hands on. Oh, <laughs> that's a really weird neck. You guys, check this weird neck thing out. That is a little weird. Who knows, maybe it's really cool. Okay, look at her gorgeous outfit, you guys. Oh, that's my grandson in the background. This is a really well sewn little outfit, my goodness. You know I'm picky about the outfits, but that's good. Oh, look at that. The joints work beautifully right off the bat. Woo! You know, and that is a little bit hollow plastic like the other 60 centimeter dolls, but it's a lot higher quality. Okay, it's kind of weird. She has a giant bonk in her knee there, but on the other hand, very good mobility. Oh, she has panties. That's great. Okay. Oh. Sorry, my grandson's in his dinner hour. Okay. She has, she can twist her legs so she can sit nicely. Very good. Nice ball joints there. Do a full crunch for tummy turns. There, she's got at her waist, and I'm assuming her arm, yep, but her arm has a full crunch too. That's awesome. And of course, turns and also turns this right here, rotates both at the shoulder and at the elbow. That is really cool. All right. And her hands turn. Is that a ball joint? Yeah, okay. Let me twist that way, this way. Well, that is all wonderful. Let's see if we can assemble this, Chica. Let's put your feet on first, Miha. 
not hard. So those will be easy, easy to take off and paint and put back on. Okay, let's move her knee back. There we go. And again, her body is hollow plastic, but it's a quality plastic. For instance, it feels really soft. It feels like resin. Okay, put her slippers on here before your head goes on. How about that? Okay, I'm nervous about this head because it's kind of, well, it's weird. Okay, I don't know. That's kind of weird. We're just going to try it here. I might have to heat it up with a blow dryer. No, oh, no. <laughs> We got her on without the blow dryer. And she can twist and turn. Well, oh, her earring holes aren't really holes. Oh, that's really pretty. And another little clip. Not the way they showed it in the picture, but I like it better that way. Um, yeah. The ear holes are going to have to be punched out. Let's see if we can remove her arms. Okay. Oh, yeah. And put her other hand in. It's in the exact same position almost as the other hand. Maybe not as necessary to remove them. Maybe they're just extras in case or something. Let's see if we can do here. There. So thank you for watching. You guys, this is my big Christmas money spenditure. It cost me, I think she was $46.00. Yes, she was $46, so she cost a lot, but I like her. She's very pretty, and she has quite a nice little look to her. Isn't that beautiful? She is really pretty. She's a big doll. She's a 62 centimeter. Yeah, two centimeters bigger than the ones that we normally get. Look at her hair. She can tilt her head. That strange spine looking connection there. Actually does a good job on her head. Thank you for watching. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> yeah, she can touch her mouth just fine. Oh, that's so pretty. What a lovely doll. And I'll leave this the vendor below. I, I think she's a worthwhile purchase, you guys. Beautiful. And you won't be uh, disappointed. For those of you who do not sew, this doll has gorgeous clothing. She has a gorgeous outfit. Well, ribbon has velvet in the center and this is a really well sewn own outfit. Look at this. Very nicely finished. Beautiful. Beautiful fabric. Embroidery on the sleeves. And she has a nice pretty or dress underneath with a pretty slip. And she came with underwear. I think this is kind of supposed to be like a nighttime dressing gown. Fancy lady from 1910 or 1920. Chinoise. A negligee. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I like that. I really like her. I think she's a good deal. And the makeup is quite lovely. Look at that makeup. Yeah, that's beautiful. And her hair is very, very well done. Very, very nice. Good quality on this doll. Very good quality. All right, I'm going to leave the vendor below. And thank you very much for watching at Carol's Current Obsession today, where we always have new and interesting stuff. Sometimes from AliExpress and sometimes from eBay, Shop Goodwill, and all sorts of places. Anyway, thanks so much for coming and take care, you guys. Like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time with something else new. Bye-bye.